Have you ever felt lost about your future? Have you ever wondered which path to take that would actually lead you down to your goals? Well, if you asked any of these questions, then this video is for you because we are gonna take a look at personal vision statements and how to use them successfully. Hi, my name is Adriana Girdler. I'm a productivity specialist, president of Cornerstone Dynamics and myvisualvision.com. And in today's video, we are gonna take a look at personal vision statements and how to use them successfully. People are sometimes surprised that I tell them that a person can really benefit from an individual vision statement because when you hear a vision statement, you really think of the corporate or organizational vision statements. But guess what? There is a great reason why they are used because they are a fantastic strategy tool. They allow you to understand where exactly do you wanna go? And then from there, break things down into manageable chunks that are executable, which is why a lot of organizations are very successful. So. Here's why, as an individual, you really need to take a look at your own personal visual vision statement. The key is to use it as your own personal GPS, your own compass in life, so that you can say yes and no to the right decisions. Before we move on, what exactly is a personal vision statement? A personal vision statement embodies the person's highest value and aspiration. It inspires people to reach for what could be and to rise above their fears and preoccupation with current reality. So in essence, it is a picture of how you want your life to be. So what are the benefits of vision statements? Because if I'm not convincing you yet that you even need to have one, let's think about those benefits. So the three benefits are, number one, it clarifies what you really want out of life and I'm not talking about the superficial stuff. Okay, I know we want a house and a car and all that stuff, but I want you to go beyond that. Really go inward to understand down the road, have you achieved what you know is truly in your heart's desire? Not about the stuff, that will come, but have you really touched inward to understand who you are and what you're about? The second benefit is once you understand your vision statement, it allows you actually to create goals. Man, that is really important because I don't drive around to a brand new location without understanding my map, my really my Google map to understand how to get there. And in life, we shouldn't do the same thing, but yet we do. So by understanding what your vision is, the other benefit is it allows you to actually create the goals that you need and to break those down into manageable tasks. And last but not least, even more important than all the rest is your personal vision statement it can be your litmus test. It allows you to vet things through it to ensure that is every decision you're making allowing you to achieve ultimately what you want out of your life. So how do you even write a vision statement? Well, I actually have a workbook right over here. You can check it out on my website, myvisualvision.com, and it really goes through all the steps that you need to really understand inwardly what is it that you want who are you really? What do you desire? Um, how exactly do you want your life to unfold? And it's very in depth and I highly recommend it. However, you just don't have to do my workbook. There's tons of things on the internet as well. My recommendation is you take this journey to actually find what your vision is. But more importantly, what I wanna spend my time on is how to use it successfully. Because what I find a lot in corporations and with individuals is you spend all this energy effort on creating your vision statement and then you file it away and you never look at it. So why put that energy and effort if you're not gonna use it in a, as an actual tool? So let's talk about that. So how do you use it so that you can be successful? Well, the number one tip I recommend is surround yourself with it. Take a look behind me. <laughs> That's my personal vision statement. I have it on canvas. I have it everywhere. I have it on screensaver on my computer. I have it on my phone. Not only do I have this one here in my office office, I have it in my home office. You have no idea how important it is to have it with you all the time. Because when the doors of opportunity come knocking, you're not gonna be necessarily in one location where your vision statement is. You're gonna be in lots of places. So you want that reminder to go, I'm gonna stay on course and I'm gonna either say yes or no to that opportunity because it is aligned with what I am and who I am. Other things you can do is mouse pads. So here's mine on a mouse pad, but not only that, is I even have my team members, they have theirs on their mouse pads because guess what? At Cornerstone Dynamics, we believe in what we preach. 
and I really believe in this. I can't tell you how it is so easy to get what you want out of life when you are clear with what you want out of life. So surround yourself with your vision and use it every day as a litmus test. Take a look at it, wake up, understand, is, am I doing everything in my power in order to achieve what I want with my vision? Because again, the vision statement is your own internal GPS, your compass in life. And in my own personal story, which I'm so excited about without my vision here, there's some things I just would never have achieved. I've written books. I became a TEDx speaker. I traveled the world on business, which is all part of my personal vision here. And there's so much more. And every day, I'm always looking to make decisions that are aligned with my purpose. So when I get asked, how is it that you accomplish so much, Adriana? It's not because of luck. It is because I'm very clear with what I want. And so when opportunities present themselves, I ensure that they're in line with my vision. And you can do the exact same thing. So to recap, if you want to get the most out of your life, then you need to have a vision statement. Number two, with that vision statement, you have to break things down into manageable chunks, break them down into goals so you know what you're trying to achieve. And you can do that many ways, through the workbook, on the internet, there's lots of resources out there to have you know how to create one and how to break it down in manageable chunks. But most importantly, don't file it away. Use it every day as your litmus test and have it around you. I promise you, if you were to do these simple things, it makes a huge difference. On that note, I want to thank you for watching this video. If you can give it a thumbs up, that'd be greatly appreciated. Subscribe to the button below and please share this with your family and friends. The more people who are in line with their vision, the better off this world will be. Thanks so much and I'll see you at the next video. Thank you.